Hey guys, yet another LEGO Indiana Jones here. This is Guy Cushion 9, and today we are doing my most hated course ever Motorcycle Escape. Yep. This, we have to get four treasures and the parcel, so let's get started. First, blow this metal thing here. That used to tie up these boats. And uh, what you want to do is get a female character out and just go over this way. I know in the movie we're not supposed to use the boats, but you're supposed to move the boats here. And yeah, whatever. Alright, so uh, use a woman to jump over there. And there you go. There's number one. So let's go back. Ah. Gotta find the... There it is. Alright, so number two, get your explosive guy out again. And blow up that gate. And now just start blowing stuff up. And you see here, we got some checkers. Oh, not. Ah, ha, look at that. Fell right on there. Lucky us. But anyways, pull that back. And there we go, another treasure in a weirdly placed pool. So, okay, so I'll skip ahead to the next treasure. Hooray! Okay, here, after the second jump, is where we got our next treasure. And it's really easy. Just, uh, close the guy. And, uh, take your bike and drive over it. Very easy. All right, let's go to the final area, or by what I mean is the final area that has treasure in it. Oh! Okay, so I'm in this room now. This is the barn in that one area. And what you have to do first is you fix this tractor, not once, but twice. And when you do so, get on it. And they will let you go outside. Oh, looky there. Now take the tractor and do as the farmers would do and run over these plant uh, plant gardens here. And you'll reveal carrots. Run over all three. And there's your treasure over there. So you're going to have to extend the bridge for that. <laughs> Evil. But anyways, uh... Oh, look at the art, true adventurer. I am awesome. Anyways, uh, blow this thing up here to get a key. Put it here. Kill this man. Kill myself. And then start pulling the thing, and that'll start activating the windmill for some reason. Just keep pulling, and eventually that little door will open. I'm going to go ahead and build this because I need to anyways. Yeah, you see, it spits out a box. Put the box here. And switch to your female character. And there's your parcel. So now we got to mail it. And it's just right over here. No worries. No problem. Yeah, see, here's your mailbox right here. So that's another uh, thing. And you see, this is what this are Actually, I guess I was wrong about disarm enemies. You can still take their weapons. They just don't shoot you. And boy, does that make things easier, doesn't it? Huh? Also, what I forgot to mention is that free play, you don't lose studs when you die for some reason. It's free play. But that's number 10. We got the parcel, so I don't have to go into that insane area with all the explosives. So let's just go to the results. Treasure times eight. Now oh, we're getting some pretty powerful treasure multipliers now, aren't we? Although I believe that one's four million, so it's even further out of my reach. As I only have about 400,000 at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What did I get? Oh, look, a picture. I didn't get to see what it was, though.
Well, I said it before, but I'm definitely meaning it now. I am glad I'm done with that course. Seriously, I hate that course so much. But, uh, yeah, free play definitely makes it easier to do because, again, you don't lose studs when you die. So, yep. Yeah. And plus, when you have all the ridiculous amount of parcels that you have active like me, it certainly does pose little threat. And that should make some of you happy out there. Hooray. Yeah, C4 mil. But, um, that's pretty much it. This is Guy Christian 9 saying, let's, well, we're pretty much done for this episode. Stay tuned for Trouble in the Sky. Hopefully, I won't be glitched in that course again. We can only hope, though.